Hi YouTube, how are you doing? And welcome back to Phasmophobia. The developers just released the Halloween update, as you can see. And in this video, I'm quickly gonna cover what's in this update, the Halloween event, as well as the other changes. And then while I'm uploading this video, I will be live both over on Twitch and on YouTube live streaming, covering everything in the update thoroughly. But anyway, first of all, the new thing here, Halloween event 2023. Complete this year's Halloween challenge to earn an exclusive Halloween trophy and ID card. Enter any location featuring a pumpkin sticker on any difficulty. Wait, pumpkin sticker? Oh, we got lots of pumpkin stickers, except Sunny Meadows and Brownstone High School. It seems like every other one has it. Um, Enter any location featuring a pumpkin sticker on any difficulty. Find the recipe ingredient note found in a pumpkin's mouth. Retreat to the truck and leave. And uh, when we're playing this, we're also going to probably play some games, actually. Because there might be some other sneaky stuff like uh, the ghost might have pumpkin heads or something like that. At least that's what they had in the previous update. Once you know the full recipe, head to Maple Lodge Campsite, the new Maple Lodge Campsite, and add the ingredients to the cauldron. Enjoy your 2023 rewards. Now, besides that, I'm also going to quickly go over for the patch notes the actual patch notes here it is halloween event update 9.1 Halloween. Halloween event 2023 has been added. Instructions can be found in the game, as we just read. How to receive this year's spooky ID card badge and trophy. Very exciting. The event will last around two weeks, so very important. Two weeks. And Maple and Prison are temporarily unlocked at level one to allow new players to complete the event as well. New. Maple Lodge Campsite has had a complete layout revamp featuring a new reception building, two separate campsite areas, new assets and areas, more hiding spots, and greatly improved performance that's very exciting added new rain sound in both campsites when inside tents inside the toilet block or under draped tarp sounds comfy uh, added new anti-aliasing option temporal anti-aliasing option in the journal higher quality than fxaa and M smaa but lower quality than msaa okay thank you uh and then the eu la has been upgraded updated whatever changes several icons have been replaced across the main menu and contract selection screens you can no longer light objects using interact default mouse but mouse one okay to help with performance in the truck the cctv monitor will now only turn on when you are standing nearby and it will now display a screensaver when disabled okay and then we have a bunch of fixes here the monkey paw now has correct textures again wait that was a bug i swear that was just intended okay because the monkey paw looked super like dry and like uh, dried out basically but apparently that was a bug i had no idea you can now take a photo of the haunted mirror on richview whilst it's on the wall very nice so a lot of people confused about that in training you can now open close the truck doors in vr several fingerprints are no longer visible when you don't have uv evidence lamal <laughs> crucifix tier 2 should now cons consistently give both interaction and burned crucifix photos let's go the haunted mirror will no longer get detected on the parabolic mi microphone or sound sensors if not being held or used thank you very much the camp woodwind entrance gate will no longer say maple lodge campsite which was very silly video cam no longer breaks if swapped into inventory when cctv is on the last camera thank you very specific lighters can no longer light some candles firelights and the campfire when not lit that sounds uh obvious summoning circle photos will no longer take priority over other photos as often very nice so you would often get the ghost photo or miss the ghost photo because of the summoning circle if you die in foggy weather future games in foggy weather now show the fog correctly interesting many performance improvements especially in multiplayer and in the truck placing equipment on the wall in some areas of sunny meadows will no longer teleport the equipment back on the truck bone photos will now work more reliably firelight tier 2 now correctly last five minutes instead of three minutes oh what i have no idea all right well those are the changes and obviously there's a whole lot to do with the halloween event uh, as you can see right here in this beautiful lobby i mean look at this right here what the heck is going on we're gonna be exploring all of this live right now over on twitch and on youtube so hope to see you there anyway just wanted to inform you really quick that the update is here hope you enjoy if you're not subscribed please do so if you like the video like it if you dislike it dislike it and i hope to see you on the live stream bye bye guys have a good one